Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Luke Ness Monster, back again with another news video. Today I'm going to be talking about all the reveals with Mando Monday. And uh, yeah, so starting off, we have a new kind of like a retro line, kind of like the uh, Kenner style um, Boba Fett and then uh, uh, Zuckus and the other guy. I don't know his name, I'm sorry. But we got some more figures like that. We actually have um, the Mandalorian, Cara Dune, IG-88, or IG-11, I'm sorry, I said 88, IG-11, a um, the heavy Mando, the, the heavy infantry Mandalorian, and then a Death Trooper, all in their uh, original concept art colors, and Mando looks so, really, like, just so cool. He looks really, really cool, and um, I definitely try to get my order out as soon as possible and I'll go into the ordering oh I just hit my light I'll go into the ordering a little bit more later in the video but um so for right now I just want to throw up all the photos here's Mando first he looks really good and um I, I don't know if this is normal or not but his helmet looks like really shiny in the photo and it's weird uh, just compare it to this one though I love the blue gauntlets and it's just really cool I I'm glad they're doing this and it's just a really cool thing that they could do um, uh, I believe Mandalorian here was a Amazon exclusive so each of these uh, uh, figures were exclusive to a different website and next up is Cara Dune there isn't a whole lot that I really found different in her um, I believe her uh, armor though is a little bit more of a green than a bluish It's really the only difference I saw so, um, yeah, it looks really cool, and, uh, again, I forgot to say this before, but all of these figures come with credits, which I think is really, really cool. I don't know what they are, what they do, they're just little credits, and, um, I'm glad that's what they are, because they look cool, and I've always wanted something like this, but I didn't want to pay the expensive prices getting a custom or some of the other ones like that. So this is a cool way to get one, and I hope it's metal. I know it's not metal, but I hope it is, because it'd be so freaking cool if it was metal. But anyway, it looks really cool, and each of these are just different colors for different types of, like, uh, currency, I guess you would say. And, um, yeah, it looks really cool, and um, it's just something they added in that they really didn't have to, and I'm glad they did, because they look really, really cool. So, again, we have the Cara Dune here. She looks great as well. She was a Target exclusive. Unfortunately, I did not get my pre-order for her in time. Again, I'll go into my order process later in the video. But um, next up is IG... 11 he looks really cool he's like all rusted out and it, it looks really cool i think this could be good for some different like mocks and stuff if you wanted to make like a like a sand crawler or something you can just throw him in the background make him look like he's all rusted up i don't know uh just cool droid looks really cool he's all rusted looks cool i don't know what else to say about him he is a gamestop exclusive so uh by the way all these already went up for pre-order at uh three o'clock central time so I'm sorry if you missed out. <laughs> My video is a little bit late, but um, these already did go up for pre-order. I believe Mandalorian is still available on um, Amazon if you guys hurry up and get to him in time. I uh, don't know if he will be by the time this video comes out, but it's as, as of right now, he is. So next up is the Death Trooper. He looks cool. He looks like um, he's, he got like in a paintball fight. He just has weird different colors splotched on him, and um, it's interesting. I don't know. It looks cool. Love the card back. And, um, yeah, he is, I believe he is, a again, another Amazon exclusive. So he does look really cool. And, um, yeah, I don't know. It's just a weird thing for a Death Trooper. He just weird paint swatches on him, and it's interesting. So uh, next figure up, and the last figure is the um, Best Buy exclusive Heavy Infantry Mandalorian. And, uh, again, there's not a whole lot of paint variation in him. But it's just a different shade of like the main bluish colors. It looks like it's a different shade, and it looks pretty cool. I do like the character, and it has a really like wide card back. And unfortunately, I also missed that pre-order as well. But um, yeah, all these look really cool, and I'm glad they're doing this line because um, I'm hyped for the next season of Mandalorian, and uh, there's no better way to promote it like this. So. Um, yeah, so let's get into the order process of things. Um, you know, uh, as all Black Series figures go, uh, you gotta get there within, like, right as a pre-order comes out to be able to get the, the figure. And, um, that's one thing that's disappointing about exclusives like this, because if you miss the pre-order, the, you're probably not gonna get it. Like, um, the, uh, Walmart exclusive, uh, Clone Wars Wave, those sold out 15 minutes before they were supposed to go up. I actually have my footage of this when I ordered them. <laughs> I was there, like, 15 minutes early, and none of the photos were up on the screen yet. 
I decided to pick four random uh, figures and hope I bought the right ones. Luckily, I did. But, um, yeah, that's just one thing about Walmart's website. It's a little interesting. But, um, so, yeah, I ordered mine for, uh, or at least I, I was, uh, say it was 3 o'clock Central Time. And I am refreshing my Amazon page. I already had the link to the, the figure, and I was refreshing it, refreshing it. Right as 3 o'clock hit, it refreshed, but it brought me back to this screen. It was just like the Amazon home screen. So I refreshed again, nothing happened. So I went back to the like the Disney website or the Star Wars website where I got the link from, clicked on the link, and went back to the, it refreshed the page. The Mandalorian was up with this screen that said, out of stock or temporary unavailable or something like that and it was a span of 30 seconds or like a minute that this happened so this figure sold out in a minute and uh... you know that's just how all hasbro figures go but it's just it just kinda sucks the, I mean everybody wants to buy your products and then they're sold out within a minute it's just a little disappointing i had uh... the target exclusive cara dune up on another screen and um... i managed to get her into my cart and i was checking out and um... I went to like confirm purchase and it said there's a problem with your order and I, I did that for a few minutes and nothing changed so I refreshed the page and it said it was already sold out. So unfortunately um, I, I, I didn't really get any of those right away but about 30 minutes later uh, Mando came back in stock at uh, Amazon and I managed to get him then. So it says uh, expected date December 1st. Um, Han and Carbonite said the exact same date and he's been shipped out three times since then. And it's only September, so I, I'm pretty sure this figure will come around uh, like mid-October. I think is the expected date for the figure on other websites, so I expect him to come around mid-October. Uh, the carbonized line of these figures was a Walmart exclusive, and um, I actually got a photo from at like nine o'clock in the morning of this guy already sold out on Walmart. I don't know if it's just the fact that it never went up for pre-order or if they accidentally put it on their website again and it already sold out. It just depends. I really don't know. I never checked again afterwards, so it could just be the fact that they uh, never put it up. And that's just the screen they have while they're waiting. So, um, yeah, anyway, uh, these are really good figures, and I hope... <coughs> I'm sorry. I, I uh, hope you guys got a chance to get them. And uh, if you did, comment down below and... Um, yeah, there's not a whole lot more news to go over, so if you guys did like the video, hit that like button and subscribe, and if you guys are new to the channel, I'm doing a giveaway at 500 subscribers. I'm giving away a Camino Clone Trooper, so if you guys like Clone Troopers as much as I do, hit that subscribe button, because you do have to be subscribed to enter the giveaway, and it gets us just that much closer to the 500 subscriber mark. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.